It's 855, 82 degrees. Let's go to Marty. 95 is going to be the high this day. That's just the beginning of the story. Pages 2 and 3 are at 95. It comes up 103. On. Now, <laughs> 95 is going to be the high today. 103 heat index. It is definitely going to be a code orange chair advisory. 75 as a low. Sharon, take it away. Hey there, Marty. Good morning, everyone. Big problem now on 95. Another one, I should say. This one is going to be 95 near 100 in the northbound direction. Past Maryland, 100, I should say. Uh, both directions, we're looking at delays. Still looking at huge delays and two lanes closed on 95. That was a lane switch to northbound now at Fort, the Fort McHenry Tunnel. On the west side of the Beltway, 28 miles per hour is the latest outer loop average. Top side of the Beltway running at 34. There's a look at that stop and go traffic there on the top side. Here's a look at the west side. Lynn. Um, we've been following breaking news out of Edmondson Village. A string of fires overnight. Sean Stryker has details. It was a busy morning for Baltimore City firefighters as they battled at least four house fires and two car fires in the Edmondson Village area of Baltimore. Those fires happening within mere blocks of one another between 2 and 3.30 a.m. No word yet on whether this is being ruled arson. Reporting in West Baltimore, Sean Stryker, WJZ.